Chris 6 News at Noon continues. Not a bad looking day out there, 62 degrees on the cool side, but quite a bit of sunshine. The cloud cover actually dissipated over our area. It's still out to the west, so we expect some of that to come back. Temperatures around the region running in the 60s in most areas. Water temperature even is at 64. We're looking at 64 in Beeville and 65 down in Kingsville. Now for the winds, they have settled down and that sort of helps out uh, in making it feel chilly. But because the winds have settled down, that means that by tomorrow they'll start turning back around and giving us a, a little bit of, um, uh, of a warm up for the next day or so. Now notice we do have rain in central Texas. It is not huge, but it is happening. And that's part of that moisture that was over us that actually moved about 200 miles north. As a result, we're sort of being left out of this activity. That moisture is associated with a storm in the southwest right off of Baja, which eventually is going to start rolling up into our area, and we're going to be dealing with the, the tail end of it probably on Friday night. Southern California, Northern California, all those areas are getting very, very heavy surf as the intense Pacific storms continue winding up from the Pacific. Uh, they are definitely coming ashore and will have some impact on our area. In fact, the most curious impact is the fact that we're not very cold. Uh, Pacific storms generally are not as um, cold and therefore we're on the mild side of temperatures. Water vapor uh, will show you the uh, moisture associated with that low down to the south and this is what we're expecting. The frontal system that came through is going to fall apart and then it's going to turn into a south wind. So while we're cool today, we'll be a little bit milder by the time we get to Friday. Then on Friday night, that little frontal system will start moving into the state. It will come through our area with a little bit of rain, and that's Friday night into Saturday morning. But the good news is by Saturday, north winds return and blow away all that moisture. It'll be a little cooler by the time we get to the weekend as temperatures are going to be uh, actually a little bit uh, shy of the 60 degree mark. So take a look at your seven day forecast. 64 today, up to about 70 tomorrow with the clouds increasing. A few little light rain showers on Friday night, but then it all goes away on Saturday. We've got a beautiful Sunday, but a crisp Sunday. We're looking for a high of 58. And for Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday, we'll be below 60 degrees as high temperatures, overnight lows down into the 40s. Your seven day forecast brought to you by NEC Co op Energy.